Good morning. We talked about public education in the podcast, but I didn't get the chance to talk about something I really love talking about, some people who are maybe some of the coolest and best people in the the public education system. I am, of course, talking about C students. In school, I was the kind of student that you might describe as the lazy A. You know, the person who shows up to class and you know knows a bunch of stuff, but doesn't really seem to try very hard. The person who, who gets decent grades when they get grades, in my case, but doesn't really care and gets a lot of notes on their, on their assignments about needs to apply self, could work harder, has potential. And they just sort of breeze through the rest of it, looking bored often being a dick because they don't understand that other human beings are struggling with this material because it's easy for them and therefore it must be simply be easy. Yeah, I was one of those people until I got to university where I had to work my ass off, which was good because that was what I needed. But C students, you know, B students and C students, god damn, they're so cool. It is easy to... Everyone knows those those people in school. I am not one of those people, but everybody knows those people who are going to go on to do great things. You know, the people who are so smart, they, like, scare you because they know everything. And, you, and, and sometimes it's because they're really, really good at stuff. Sometimes it's because they work really, really hard. The, the best ones are usually the ones who do both. The people who work really hard and are also naturally good at whatever it is that they are studying. They have a genuine passion for it and a skill at it and it is crazy. And they are brilliant. And it is easy. I mean, those are the students that we love to sort of hold up as the successes of education and things like that. But those students, honestly, I think that they were going places anyway. I mean, public education helps them along, but Even without public education, they would figure something out and they would do it. But C students, C students are the ones who have to fucking try. You know, they're the ones that work four hours a night for a B. You know, they're the ones putting in sweat and blood into every assignment and fretting and worrying about it because... I mean, they're actually, they're not trying to make a good grade better. They're trying to make an average grade good. And I don't know. I don't know that we tell those, uh, them that they have enough, they have potential or anything like that. I don't know what you tell a C student. I was really a C, that kind of C student. You know, the kind that works really hard. But there are a lot of them. And I have had the privilege of knowing a whole bunch of them. Sometimes in the context of tutoring or being in classes or I've had roommates and like that. And it's those students who I think are the, the meat and the most important part of public education. You know, people who are, who are straight A students, we're, we're going to, you, know, you know, they're going to seek this stuff out. People who are C students are beating their heads against something that they find genuinely difficult because it matters to them. That is an admirable trait in any human being. The ability to continue to tackle problems no matter how hard they are because it is important that you solve them. Maybe it's important because you want a certification. Or maybe it's important because you want a grade. Or maybe it's important because you, maybe you just might figure something out. Whatever it is, you care, they care about it enough to keep working at it despite not always having great returns. Despite not being celebrated at every other kind of event and not winning tons of awards and etc etc they do, they do it all in quiet in the dark just trying to build that up and be good at something c students are fabulous we joke about it sometimes i mean george bush uh was a c student at uh yale i think it was And he gave a talk there once while he was president in George W. Bush. And he said uh, to the C students, 
you too could be president of the United States. And there's something sort of condescending about that, about the notion that, you know, George W. Bush partied his way through school and he's super rich. And there's lots of reasons why his being a C student and also being president were not at all correlated. But, I mean, the, there are lots of C students who work crazy hard. And they work crazy hard not for accolades, not for the admiration of their peers and teachers. They work hard because what they are studying matters to them. And this is as true in, 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 in workplace as it is in school. But I don't think we talk about them enough. And we should. If you are a C student, leave a comment. If you are not a C student, still leave a comment. I love comments. And I will see you guys later.